Well, the reaction to bin Laden's death was swift and stunning, even to those covering the war in Afghanistan. You complained a lot with the 100 degree heat. I, Remember all those days, like 43 <laughs> days uh, this summer? I tried not to doesn't complain look so bad too now, much, does it? but yeah. I am kind of missing it. Parts of the city are completely unrecognizable, total devastation. Now, cars and trucks are stacked and strewn everywhere. Power lines are down. People are just kind of walking around in a daze. I know it's a cliche, but it's like a bomb dropped right here from miles around. It's like a war zone. And you can tell where the uh, the tornado skipped over and went over some trees. The tops of the trees are off, but the houses are fine. It's wet, it's cold, it's gloomy here in Stillwater and also sad. Now sadness has gripped this OSU campus as the university pays tribute and honors those killed in last week's plane crash. All right, we're gonna head back to Frank now. Frank, uh, let us know there, are, are we done with uh, the weather? Oh, can we not worry about that anymore? Saving money on that trip to the grocery store takes more than just cutting out coupons. That certainly helps. We didn't have to wait long to catch a driver who didn't belong in a handicapped parking spot. You know what the fine is now? No. If they enforce it, it's $500. Is it really? And I understand the big guy may even be here. He's Ooh. trying to clear his schedule. The Are big you, guy, you know yes. who that is, don't you? Making an early appearance. That's We're right. To see Santa. I'm talking about uh, Frank Mitchell. Okay. And <laughs> <laughs> we have a front row seat, and you at home have a front row seat of this wonderful parade today. Probably the best seat in the house. It's Channel 8's Keith Taylor. He's going to be on the street throughout the morning. Keith, uh, good morning to you. Look at her belt buckle. Look at mine. <laughs> Look at my shoes. Look at her boots. Who do you think has the edge today in uh, today's Anchor Challenge? <laughs> All right, wraps it up here. A depressing night for the Sooners <laughs> and their fans. Jubilant Woo! night for Kristen and all the OSU fans. 44-10 yeah. the final. Let's, uh, it's, right. it's a good game. You played let's well. Let's warm up now, get in line, <laughs> and fight the traffic back to Tulsa. Back to you, Yvonne.